you get to a point where you realize that the system is controlling you and you, you, you say enough's enough. I need to control this process. Nobody is going to look out for my son the way we are going to look out for our son. And that's when it that's when it changed. That's when we really realized that we need to take control. We need to make a difference in his life because no one else is going to care like we do. It wasn't just about the kids. It became about the families. It became about what we did and what we created here at SECO for the parents and the family because when you have a child with motor disabilities, you have to run them around all day long and you come home and you got to sit there and do therapies and you got to do these things and it doesn't allow you to have a life or to take a breather and it makes it very difficult. So what we've been able to do is to, to restore the family life of the, the families that come to SECO. And I think that's really what, what SECO represents. It's not only helping kids, but it's helping families to, to do better in the community.